Uh, I've got several things to talk about uh, since last episode. Um, but as you can see on the top of my screen, um, my base is being raided. Um, so real quick, we're going to go ahead and do this. I've been holding off on it, um, but I can't think of a better opportunity to do this. By the way, you might notice some things are different uh, than last video. We'll get to that. Um, I want to take care of this first. Um, so I'm going to grab my diamonds. My village is being raided. I don't know if they can destroy any of my stuff. I'm not sure how that works. First things first, let's make a diamond pickaxe. We finally got it. We've got the diamond pickaxe. If I don't die in this raid, um, I will definitely get it enchanted. Let's go ahead and make a diamond chest plate. We're going to go all out. The reason why I'm being raided is uh, one of the last times I played... Um, there was uh, some pillagers. They were literally just standing on the outside of my house. And they were just staring at me like, Hey, what's up? <laughs> hey, what's up, man? They were pointing their crossbows at me. They weren't really doing anything. But uh, they were uh, definitely checking me out. And it was getting a little annoying. Um, so I killed them. Um, and next thing you know, I run off, I go do something else. Um, I come back to my base, and I've got this raid message here. Let's go ahead and rest. Alright, let's do it. Uh, let's try to do it. Is it even my base they're raiding? I, I was under the impression once you ring this bell, you could see the outline of the, uh, pillagers. Can they, do you guys, if anyone watching this knows if they can uh, actually like destroy my stuff, let me know. Um, because if they're in no rush to get here, uh, then I'm in no rush to fight them, honestly. Alright, well we'll put that on pause. Uh, something else I wanted to talk to you guys about that, just to ignore the raid bar for now. Um... So, unfortunately, um, last, if you guys watched last episode, I did a lot of things, got the base kind of set up, um, did all kinds of stuff, got pets, the horse pen, whole nine yards, you can watch the video, um, but what I didn't realize is that I was playing in the snapshot version of the game, which basically just lets you play in the, like, newest releases, um, it's not... They don't quite have all the bugs worked out on them. Um, it's kind of like a test play almost. Um, and in playing in Snapshot, um, if you try to switch back to the actual release of the game, um, it can cause data corruption. Um, and that's exactly what happened. Um, I had heard that this could happen with playing in snapshot so I I tried to switch my game um, and when I did uh, everything seemed fine but anytime I tried to mine any block in the game my game crashed um, that save file is stuck like that it is that save file is it's not gonna work um, so what I did was I backed up my world um, and then reloaded it into the actual uh, version that works um, but by doing that I lost all the progress that I had I'm sure you guys noticed that my house looks different um, my farm is gonna look a little bit different um, I don't have the the wolf anymore um, I don't have a horse anymore I was extremely lucky because I realized that when I load the backup save, everything in my world is basically deleted except for what is in my inventory. Um, so I guess this is the positive side of this matter. Um, because I just, before I saved the backup file, I went and got all my valuables, put them all in my inventory. Um, I got my diamonds. Um, a bunch of blocks basically all the necessities and the important things I didn't want to lose um, and I was able to bring them over last episode I went to the village and uh, checked their treasure chest and got a couple diamonds 
um, now that this world was reset, I went back there. Um, and in the same treasure chest that had the two diamonds the first time, it had some other things. But one of the things it had was this, and that is the diamond horse armor, um, which is really rare. I didn't even know you could get that in a villager's treasure chest. Um, so I got really lucky on that. As you see, the house is a little bit different. The railroad system is a little bit different. I didn't get to keep um, all my railroad tracks. Um, I got as many as I could. Um, I had to rebuild this whole thing down here. Um, yeah, so this is where uh, my, kind of my underground base was in the last episode. Um, this time around, I made it a lot bigger. Um, I, I think it was about half this size in the first video. I would like to find some obsidian because uh, what I want to do is go ahead and make an enchanting table. Uh, go ahead and make an enchanting table. Um, get some leather from the cows. Um, make some... Um, go ahead and make some books, some bookshelves. Get that whole thing situated. Um, that way I can get some armor enchanted. Use these enchanted levels before I go fight the pillagers. Um, that way I don't risk uh, losing my levels. Well... The lava was a little bit easier to find than what I thought it was going to be. Turns out, it's right under my base. There we go. Obsidian! We did it, guys. We're making advancements. There's the book. And here is the enchanting table. We did it, guys. We did it. I'm always hearing some monster noises. And no monsters? That sounds like a lot of monsters in here. There they are. Hello! Ha! Yes! Come, come to your demise. Come burn to death. Oh man! Creeper! Oh man! No ducky! No! Oh! It's not a duck, he's a chicken, I'm sorry. Is there a monster spawner down there or something? Oh! Oh! Uh! Wow. Alright, let's go get back to the house. I need to sleep! I need to sleep! Let's go to bed. Sugar cane, sugar cane. Perfect. I, I'm gonna, sometime I'll have to change that to sand, but, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. Alright, alright, alright. Yes, yes, yes. Look at the sheep, dude. They barely fit in here. Oh my god. I don't want to kill the babies. I don't want to kill the babies. I don't want to kill the babies. I wonder if the cows are just sitting over there like, Oh my god! Are we next? In case you guys haven't noticed, this is also one of the fastest ways to level up. Not all, You get experience for breeding the animals. Um, every time they have a baby, you get experience for that. Um, and then you get experience for... Uh, killing them and then you get experience for cooking the meat um, it, it's a uh, there's a lot of experience to get in just farm animals alone um, you really don't even have to obviously we're going to but uh, if you wanted to you wouldn't even have to really play the rest of the game because I mean all you would have to do is sit at your base, farm animals, and, uh, yeah, that's really it. Just farm animals. Uh, farm animals get your enchantment levels, and then enchant your gear. And then, when you're finally decked out, then you can go venture out into the world. <laughs> if you wanted to. I'm glad these horses are sticking around and not despawning. It sucks, man. 
that uh, the last episode, I, I finally saw the Wandering Traveler and we got uh, those two leashes. I didn't get to keep them and it sucks because now I can't um, get any horses in the pen uh, until I get like, unless I either find the Wandering Traveler or, uh, or find a saddle somewhere, but <laughs> I think either of those is just as likely as the other. That I already got distracted. I was supposed to be making the uh, the smoker. How many can I make? There we go. Oh yeah, that's right. I was looking for coal. Yeah, I knew I had some in here. Yeah, this cooks uh, much faster. Okay, we'll do this uh, last feeding session here. And uh, we'll hop in there and uh, see if we can't get us some leather. We're just gonna hop on in and start killing. I just love killing. You guys aren't worth a full undamaged axe. Even though I've gotta use one anyways. Chip chop, chip chop, chip chop, chip chop. Just the sound of death. <laughs> Look at all of the baby cows just running to the one mother cow. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Not really. Oh my god, there's a creeper in my house? What? What the hell is that? Why is there a creeper in my house? No! Ugh! Why? Bruh. One of the cows put him up to it. I know it. I know it. It was one of the cows. Your house is where you feel the safest. And then you la 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 open the door and there's a creeper inside your bedroom. It's like a WTF, bro. Level 39 off of that. Okay, so I got 64 leather plus 31. 95. That was 95 cows uh, that I killed. Animal farming on PC seems a little overpowered, but... Hey... I'll take it. <laughs> Alright, let's get some sleep. Let's go check the, uh, ba 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 ba. What's it called? Yeah, this right here, sugar cane. Check the sugar cane one more time. Hopefully we'll have enough materials to make all 15 bookshelves. I already have this paper here. I think all the paper I have is what's on me. So to make a book, I need three pieces of paper and one leather. What do we need? Uh, planks? Do we need planks to make bookshelves? I don't know. There we go. So a bookshelf, one bookshelf is three books and six planks. So how many can we make off the bat here? I think I uh, overshot it a little bit there. Yeah, we're definitely going to have um, enough materials to make the bookshelves. Bam, there's uh, 15 bookshelves. Let's make a couple other ones just for show, for the little room. Let's see how much uh, experience we get off these uh, stack of 64 stakes. So I've got half a bar left until level 40. And Okay, so it got basically two bars. Um, a whole thing of stakes gives me two bars. I like how I... Uh, I was doing all this because I was worried about the pillagers and everything. Um, I didn't want to die and lose my levels, but I, it looks like they've gone. It looks like they've completely left. I didn't know that. I, f I thought they would just be here until I killed them. I didn't think they would just kind of like disappear. Hopefully I didn't like miss out on anything. All right, so now we can get rid of these torches. One, two, three, four. 
One, two, three, four! Yeah, how does this look? This look like crap? All right, so yeah, uh, this is not completely finished. There's still a little bit more decorative things I want to do. But the main thing is the whole reason why we did this. This is what we came for. So let's put these in here. Uh, I guess first things first, we'll see what we can get on the pickaxe. Efficiency four right off the bat. That is awesome. Uh, hopefully I can get multiple things on it. It's really all luck from here. But efficiency four is definitely a uh, great one to start out with. Um, efficiency, uh, from how I understand it works, is um, the higher level of efficiency you have on a tool, the faster that tool is. Um, and when you get up there to four and five, it's just crazy. I think I'm going to go with efficiency on the diamond. Oh, yes. Um, oh, advancement made. Um, but yeah, unbreaking three and efficiency four. That is awesome. Awesome. That is a great enchant to get right off the bat, uh, especially for our first one, man. We couldn't, I couldn't ask for anything better than that. Oh, that's a tough one, man. It's between fire aspect and protection three. I'm gonna go with fire aspect. Let's do it. Oh, and smite four. Dude, I'm getting lucky. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah, boy. Um, and I've still got 28 levels to go. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Is it nighttime? Yep. Ugh. I really got to do something about this uh, railroad soon. It's getting really <laughs> tedious walking up and down. <laughs> uh, it's just a, a, a guess here, guys. I don't think there's a limit on the animals you can have. Just uh, call it a hunch. I don't know. Jesus Christ. Well, unfortunately... Unfortunately guys, it looks like the uh, Raiders have left that kind of sucks because I was really looking forward to fighting them um, <laughs> It just took me forever to get everything ready, but hey, we still had fun. Oh my god We made a lot of advance. Would you guys get in here already? Let me uh, just run over here and double check make sure the Raiders aren't just like kind of chilling Just like waiting on me Nah, they're not. We'll have to get them next time. Next time, though, when they come, uh, I'm going to be prepared. And I'm going to whoop some ass. Oh, you guys see that? You guys see the pickaxe? Look how much faster that is than before. I don't know if you can tell the difference. Oh, there's a creeper. Oh, there's my fire aspect. Get toasted. Oh, hey. <laughs> hey, guys. What's up? Just hanging out over here? That's cool. I didn't mean to interrupt. Yeah, this pickaxe is so much faster than a uh, regular unenchanted iron pickaxe. <laughs> I can't tell you how long I was... Uh, debating on just making a diamond pickaxe uh, while I was off camera but I wanted to make sure I saved it for you guys I I wish it was more of a meaningful moment when I did it but um, it, it had to be done like I said with the uh, pillagers coming I, I wanted to get some things on the road I really don't know if they can uh, destroy any of my stuff I know if they attack a village, like an actual village, they can kill the villagers and, um, if I'm not mistaken, like, break into their doors and I don't know if they, like, take anything. Huh? What? Alright, where is that guy? I heard him. I heard him and his llamas. Is he underground? That's whack. 
Whack! <laughs> Look at those guys! No, go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Wow. <laughs> there he is! Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. Uh huh. Is he invisible? Huh? All right. Yeah, you don't have anything I want. Die. Uh, yeah, I got my leashes. Ooh, is that an Enderman? Ooh! Oh God! <laughs> ah! Where did the Enderman go? Ah! Oh, dang it! I did not want him to blow up. I'm tired of him blowing my yard up. Well. I don't know where the Enderman went, unless he's in my house, but, nope, not in my house, that's fine, sleep, so lastly, dude, those spiders, wow, they go up in flames, man, now that we have the leashes, been looking at this dude up here, for a long time. Come on, buddy. Wow, there's a lot of spiders. All right, and you too, buddy. I take you somewhere new. Come with me. Come with me, and you'll see a world of your imagination. Oh yeah. Oh, you know what? We still gotta go get. Uh, we've gotta go get another dog. I Wow, I completely, that completely slipped my mind. All right, man, that, I don't know if you guys heard that, but that scared me. I thought it was a creeper. That was just the sound of me punching grass. Um, but I, for a split second, got terrified. Anyways, anywho, whatever. I think I'm going to leave it here for now, guys. Every episode, I feel like we make a ton of progress. I know, I feel like I say this in every episode, but um, in this episode, we got uh, diamond. Um, well, first off, I, I had to rebuild my entire world. That sucked, but here we are. Um, so I rebuilt the entire world. I got a diamond pickaxe, diamond sword, diamond axe, diamond chest plate. And diamond legs. We got horses again, finally. Uh, we got our leashes, so we finally were able to get the horses back to the pen. Uh, what else we do? We got an enchanting room. That's right. We got an enchanting room um, with all our bookshelves um, so we can get the max level enchantments every time we hit level 30. We missed the raid, but that's okay. Um, I'm sure there will be more. Pretty soon, I'll be actively looking for some. I'll be uh, exploring and trying to find some villages. Hopefully, uh, we can find some raids out there, and uh, we can knock them out. I think that'd be really fun. If you guys liked the video, please give it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next video. My favorite song is on, on. Yeah. You tell me everything is okay.